everyone how's it going motion maestro here back with another video in this video i will be talking about a template that i have been working on for software development teams which is the software developer os without any further ado let's jump right into the video as you can see i am inside the software developer os template uh, the home page itself contains a bunch of things if i click on this page then i will be redirected inside the template itself first you can uh, see the navigation section where you will see a bunch of important things over here the first one is the sprint tasks uh, from this page you will be able to manage and track all your sprint related tasks uh, as you can see here uh, you can track your current sprint all sprints and all tasks from here if I go back to the navigation section then the next section we have is the projects overview section from here you can manage add or update any projects that you or your team is working on so if i go ahead and click on this friends service or project then i should be able to see all the documentation kt onboarding and personal notes or anything in general that is related to the friends project or service you can add more documentation or update anything or remove any documentation or notes from here this would look something like this if i go back to the navigation section again Then the third section we have is the learning resources section from here you can manage uh, all the learning resources related to the technologies that you are currently going to learn or have been learning so here in this section we already have a bunch of resources for aws docker google cloud platform java javascript kafka and kubernetes so if you want to add any resource uh, for any technology that you have been learning then you can do so from here you can also create new categories for any technology that you have been working on and add a resource this would look something like this it would have a source the url and the category then the fourth section we have is the my team section from here you would be able to manage your entire team uh, if you want to onboard a new team member you can do it from here you can update or remove team members from here as well if i go ahead and click on team member then you would be able to see a few details of that particular team member then we have the deployments section from here, here you can track all your deployments uh, that you are going to do in the future or have already done this is the all deployments table and here you can track all the upcoming deployments meaning the deployments that have been scheduled for the future if you have completed the deployment you can mark it as completed then we have the code snippets section from here you can manage all the useful code snippets that uh, you found on online or you found useful uh, we have a bunch of programming languages here javascript python and java you can add your code snippets in this format then we have the quarterly roadmap from here you can manage all the epics and quarters uh, related to your development team so an epic is nothing but a bigger track which consists of uh, many tasks inside it uh, so you can create epics and assign all the tasks that are related to that epic from this table then the next section we have is the merge request tracker or the pull request tracker from here you can track and manage all the merge requests or pull requests that are related to your team uh, from this table you can manage all the merge requests that have been created by you that need your review that are overdue that are important and all the merge requests that you or your team has been working on then if i go ahead to the home page we have the current sprint over here as well the projects overview as well the to do tasks where you can create uh, a particular to do item for today or uh, all time to do items you can mark them as complete and you can add them add a date as well then we have the upcoming deployment section then we have the team section itself so template you can find the link of this template in the description of this youtube video you can purchase this template from gumroad and if you love this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel i will be making more such notion tips tutorials and template videos in the future and i will see you in the next video